even two months later, every time you turn around, you're uncovering another issue. It was a record-breaking storm that broke the back of several buildings in the South Towns, especially in Hamburg. BJ's Wholesale Club in Blaisdell closed because of a twisting main beam. Schmidt's collision in glass crumbled. The service bays at Mr. Tired crushed. And the showroom at Collie's Pools and Spas split from end to end. It is very devastating, and financially it does... Um, you know, push you a little upside down. The good news is BJ's has been saved. You know, BJ's wholesale uh, is expected uh, to be open sometime next month. But Schmidt's has been torn down and the service bays at Mr. Tire demolished. Two important businesses that town officials hope make a comeback. You know, we're trying to get these businesses back open as soon as possible. Crews are just now finishing demolition at Collie's Pools and Spas on Camp Road. It's still open with employees trying to work out of trailers. Well, we lost our whole retail showroom, um, a lot of the stuff that was inside of it. But the cost of rebuilding is substantial and not fully covered by insurance. We're hoping that we'll be able to get some assistance. I don't know at this point, you know, if, if FEMA's going to reimburse any any of those uh, out-of-pocket expenses. The town of Hamburg is also out millions caused by cleanup, the total still being calculated for FEMA. But it could end up being around $3 million and without reimbursement. It could be that, that there's an increase uh, in in uh, the tax rate next year uh, because of the storm. This November storm also threatened to destroy an important source of spring flowers from Eden. But coming up at six, we'll show you how one local farm family is doing everything it can to try to make sure that does not happen. In Eden, Ed Riley, 7 Eyewitness News.